everybody, it's Barry Bashkoff again. I want to continue to show you the new electrical system that Osage is installing in all of their new vehicles. This will be the third vehicle that we've installed. The new system, and it's part of that VMOX program from Weldon Electronics, but we don't have the Vista screens. Now, the Vista screens are an option if you want to get them, but most people like to push on push off switches which is exactly what this system is so each button in this vehicle now is a push on push off system and I don't have the electric on so you can't see it functioning but when you press the button uh, we have uh, indicator lights to come on to show you what's going on there's four extra switches here so if the customer has more items that we want to turn on and off we can but your conventional stuff is all on this rear panel with your dome lights left side right side you have the electric oxygen the suction unit, the exhaust on the left side, and the right side they have the attendant light which is under here and a switch to turn the air conditioning on and off. It's in the same position as it is in most ambulances. It's over on the action wall. But behind it is the brains of what makes this thing operate and this is what they call nodes. So you'll notice in this truck there's two nodes, one left, one right, and each node can handle 32 functions. So the outside lights are connected to these nodes as well. The inside lights and all your electrical stuff are connected to these nodes. And they're very easy to diagnose. There are ports right there is one. And moving over to the other node there is the second port. And what those ports do is they give us the ability to hook a computer up to the system. And then the computer tells us what is inside each node and how we can rectify or change the programming of the lights or anything that you want to go on and off with the electrical system is programmed by these two nodes. Now, this makes the electrical system so much cleaner. There's so many less wires. Later on, I'll post uh, what it looks like in a conventional vehicle that we've sold already that has the old wiring system. But this is the new Osage VMOX, and it's VMOX without the Vista screens. And we think a lot of people are going to like this a lot. It's going to be a lot easier to diagnose. And it's going to make sure that things function smoothly. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, you can call me at 1-800-522-0246. Again, this is Barry Bashkoff at Cromwell Emergency Vehicles. See you soon.